This episode of Modeling History takes a look at the Hobby Boss 135th scale kit of the Sunderker Farzoig 254. This vehicle was developed by Sauer in Austria before World War II. It used a hybrid track and wheel suspension. The idea behind this layout was that it could run more efficiently on roads in its wheeled configuration. When moving cross country, the wheeled suspension could be retracted upwards and the vehicle would use its tracks. After Germany absorbed Austria, these vehicles ended up in Wehrmacht service in World War II. I depicted mine in Africa Corps service. The Hobby Boss kit is generally good but has some issues. The link to link tracks are tiny and aggravating to assemble. Link and length would have been a much better approach. Although the kit can be depicted with the suspension in either configuration, the kit provides no guidelines regarding how far the wheels should be depressed. I turn to references for help. I painted mine starting with a coat of humbral dark gray to depict the original Panzer gray finish. I then painted the vehicle in a mix of Tamiya acrylics. In this manner, I could use some Tamiya thinner to gently degrade the tan color to resemble a sand abraded paint finish. I then used a glaze consisting of Windsor & Newton original liquid, lighter fluid, and sepia oil paint for the final weathering. The figure here is from the excellent Alpine line of miniatures. I painted the figure with Andrea and Scale 75 brand acrylics. Overall, this is a very good kit, but it could have been more fun to build if a more friendly type of track was offered. <laughs>